Uh, that coach, Todd Miles, is accused of shooting a parent who came to his house to complain about his son's playing time. He was arrested outside his home in Brooklyn this morning. Eyewitness News reporter N.J. Burkett is live in Bed-Stuy with more on this confrontation that escalated to violence. N.J.? Right, Diana, outside the 81st precinct here in Bedford Stuyvesant, where the coach is facing attempted murder charges. A statement just released now from the Department of Education calling this, quote, an incredibly shocking case. A high school basketball coach charged with shooting a parent, then allegedly trying to cover it up. Word of the arrest came as a shock to students at Paul Robeson High School in Crown Heights. Their respected basketball coach, 42-year-old Todd Miles, arrested this morning on attempted murder charges for shooting the father of one of his own players. Investigators say it happened outside the coach's home in Bedford-Stuyvesant, where Christopher Hooks confronted the coach about his son's playing time. Detectives say when the dispute escalated, Coach Miles drew a gun and shot Hooks. It happened on December 22nd. At the time, Miles allegedly told police a third person opened fire and that he himself had been grazed by a bullet. Investigators now believe it was either a ricochet or that Miles shot himself accidentally. Sources say the arrest came six weeks after the shooting, once the victim was able to speak with detectives for the first time, identifying Coach Miles as the gunman. And the statement just released tonight from the DOE, quote, these are incredibly shocking allegations. We immediately reassigned Mr. Miles away from students, and we will work to remove him from payroll as soon as legally possible, end quote. Of course, Mr. Miles remains in police custody. He is facing arraignment later tonight. Uh, sources say the victim had been intubated for a month, and police say they could not get the real story from him until the tube could be removed and the victim could finally speak.